Hello everyone and welcome back once again. It's time for Order of Battle World War 2. We're playing the Red Star DLC. And I'm a bit taken aback that these guys can't reach, but let's at least use these and put them to good use. Inflicting decent damage on the enemy air force. Now the enemy fighter will go after the Polikarpov. Uh, probably this five strength one. So meanwhile, I'll be looking to go after the Stuka and pretty much render it obsolete. They'll be quite costly to repair. Also, I can probably cut off the forces in there on the next turn by moving in this fashion. Although, I'm sure they have a unit in there specifically. So, move up here and then I can cut them off on the next turn again by moving up. And then they might not have a unit in that city. I'll actually use this BT-7 to engage that Stug. They don't seem to be putting up that much of an effort in trying to break through this area. I'm actually going to move these slightly further. This is an excellent target for the enemy bombs. Let's... Yeah, that's a shame. I'll also be moving the T-38 down here because there's very high movement. Which is very nice. Let's see, you guys just gonna stay there. You don't have any targets. Well, I could technically already cut off one of their tanks. No, that doesn't work. Wow. Seriously? I was... I mean, I knew this was there, but I was so sure I would be able to move past it. In that fashion. Well, what I'm going to do... Put you here to block off the road. Move you a bit forward. I'm gonna try and cut off the forces that are in there pretty proactively. I'll see what what comes of it. Moving back. I 
And they did go after the fighter. Excellent. What is not so excellent is that the enemy is able to break through in that sector. I'm slowing them down. But I have to be careful. Oh, no. Now they'll be able to take all of that. They'll be a lot worse than it was before. Uh, oh, okay. Well, this can still work out, I think. Just like I'm very curious to see what they will do. My calculations are correct. I can still go around that. Oh wow. You're not attacking. No, indeed. I wonder if they will. Yes, they will. Well, 13 strength, you can afford to take a bit of damage. And there we are. <laughs> Silly AI. Coming in with the naval warfare. Okay. Not entirely the way I would have hoped. Let's see though. Finishing off those guys for sure. Let's just move up first. They didn't take this, but the question is, is the city empty? There, I have no way to check it at this point. I'll just have to try. Okay, it wasn't. But that's fine. With these guys being cut off now, they'll have a pretty poor time doing pretty much anything. Definitely sending these reinforcements over up in the center, where they are duly needed. Just doing that, cutting off the panzer. They can still retreat as well. I'm just looking to repair them for now. Oh, 
Oh wow, they cannot move those two hexes. Well, I'm certainly not attacking that, but I'll put these over here so the AI can easily dispose of it. Seems the seems like the AI is also intent on letting these guys live because that's pretty sucky. Also, very low chance. I really only need to attack once there. These nibble warfer are extremely, or the warfer are extremely expensive, and they're definitely not going to repair in there. I'm very disappointed that I wasn't able to cut them off there. But I'm still working on it. So at least I'll be cutting them off here. And I'll just let these do this. Shelling the infantry to make it a lot weaker should provide additional problems for the Wehrmacht there. They're allowing me to destroy that. That's crazy. They must not have the requisition points to really repair that. So fairly surprised they're going all the way down here to attack that. They might want to destroy it. That's probably it. They retreat it. If they have more units, they could finish it off. I'm, they probably won't reconnect. No. It'll take some time, even now, before those guys are weakened enough. And they might also still get supplies from the city. It won't be enough for them, naturally. Uh, but, yeah, these tanks are still an issue. Yeah, they felt like destroying that is, is important. Fair enough. And then they can move in here and reconnect and destroy this. Ooh. That is actually pretty bad for me. Six damage, wow.
Yeah, the enemy tanks are crazy as ever. Good, good job, man. Wow, okay. Uh, special event, air support. Further air units are ready to be deployed. I actually did not deploy those units for the six command points. Let's reconnect our lines though. I mean, it, it's been fun, but... <laughs> and of course, why would they retreat? That, that would actually make sense. Because they're in such low health. They can still retreat there, so I don't really see why they wouldn't. Oh well, let's cut them off again. Definitely need to keep at it. Well. Let's get some reinforcements going. And I think this is, trying to do this is a lot more important than anything else. Cutting off these and... I'm sure they'll have infantry in the city. I have to say that I'm I'm not oh, I'm not too impressed by my deployment options. Recons are okay, but they're hardly what I need here. That's 
purchase an infantry and let's deploy one recon anyway there we go and they're needed up here is what I think they don't seem to come from down here either But I have plenty of reserves to throw at the enemy here. Move in here. Finish off the Stug. And just move slightly back. Then I'll move in the recon as well to potentially soak up some damage from those. And that finishes off two of the enemy fighters and really surprised they didn't go after that it's not befitting the AI ah, okay they do have some units there Okay, things are about to get quite busy up there. Apparently. But I can delay them with the BA-20. Such as it is. It's time to move back. There's no real reason to retake that either. Yeah, they did fall for it. Silly AI. Too easy game, too easy. Down the one maybe? No, entirely destroyed. Now that is really sucky. Okay, so the city must be empty then. Ah, okay. Wow.
it will definitely still take some time before these guys are worn out. Although, they do seem to be on their last straws. Yeah, this has helped me tremendously and I'm really happy I did this. Perfect. I'm sure they'll move up here, but for the moment, I'm still secure. It seems like they're going down. Can't allow these guys to link up with them though. Okay. So they still did have some pretty hefty forces around Krasny. Okay, that, that cuts them off once more. I also want to make sure they'll stay cut off by doing stuff like this. Okay, they're down to zero. I don't see them really doing anything much anymore. However, definitely have to move you back again. Did overextend there a little bit. Okay, getting rid of a recon is always difficult, but that went fairly smoothly. And I'll definitely pump everything into Attacking that, making sure that my line is secure, and then attacking this. You will finish off these guys, so they'll never be able to re-establish supply down in the south. Alright, things are already looking up. Might have been a little bit too hasty in going forward. Especially seeing as how they have plenty of units down there. Yeah, it's an entire invasion force. They're just timing their assaults. Now, I'm not going to say that it re this, this really sucks, but it kind of does. I mean, I know I, I can't get in here.
Well, at least I'll be... Probably able to cut them off again on the next turn and they won't regain their supply out of no nowhere. I mean, they will, they'll be in supply, but they won't get back up to full strength out of nothing. So in that regard, it's not the end of the world. Though I'm certainly not happy. Okay. Let's push them back for now. The one thing that is not so bad right now, at the very least, is the fact that the flank seems to be pretty secure. And then once that's the case, I can round them up at the center. Yeah. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so I need to move back from that particular hex since that's the, the killing part. They're probably just gonna destroy that, no? These guys are, though. <laughs> Came there right on time, seems like. Okay, they have plenty of forces down here. Yeah, I'm sorry, that doesn't help you, pal. Fairly surprised though that these guys are in a halting position.
Oh, here. Right. Okay, they linked up, but it, it's not so bad. Oh, it's the roof ramen. These guys are at one, so they'll be at zero on the next turn. No rush to go all crazy. Okay. So I do clearly need to move back there. So has to make sure that they remain cut off. I'll do this. They have a lot of armored units here, so it's very much worth it to eradicate them like this. And it does save me a lot of points in the long run. I don't think there's any way they can go through here, but you never know. Right. Nope, let's just make sure they're blocked off again. This will cut off the infantry and allow me to finish it off. If I keep attacking the Stug, it will never be able to recover. Paratroopers are very expensive. Which is rather sad. But... You know, my plan, at least so far, is working relatively well. Can't say that I'm too unhappy with the result. I do have three, four of those secondary objectives, and they're one, two, three 
four, five, six armored vehicles ready to be destroyed. So, so that should be good too. Either way, I'm going to wrap things up here. I want to thank you all for watching. Do hope you enjoyed this, and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye. Take care.